About five years ago in 2014, along with a couple of uh, colleagues at Google, Brennan Burns and Craig McLucky, we started the Kubernetes project. And honestly, I think we're all blown away with the success of the project and how it's taken off. Uh, it started small, it started with some ideas, but it really grew from there. And I think the key factors to success really are the community that formed around Kubernetes and the fact that you know, there was deep experience from Google that really helped inform us, uh, helped inform how we built and how, uh, and how we got the technology started. But since then, the creativity from all sorts of folks from all over the world has really made Kubernetes what it is. And I think there's a bright future as we look towards it continuing to evolve and the ecosystem around the project continuing to get more and more exciting. When we launched Kubernetes about five years ago, I don't think any of us expected it would take off like it did. And I think the thing that really surprised me is uh, number one, just the number of people that are using it all around the world. We found that it's being used in every corner, you know, in every industry and in all sorts of ways that we didn't predict. I think, you know, everything from we're seeing folks run Kubernetes in, you know, storefronts, tens of thousands of different installations, something we never thought uh, it would be. And we're also seeing people use Kubernetes for something like large scale data analysis of uh, say the, the, the CERN physics uh, particle accelerator. So the fact that we were able to have an impact across you know, everything from running inside stores to uh, particle accelerators, that really, really is surprising and is something that is exciting to see. VMworld Tanzu is this overarching portfolio of products that we announced at VMworld 2019. And it really consists of three different things along three different emphasis. So we think about build, run, and manage. Uh, we want to help customers build cloud-native applications, including packaging existing applications, open source, and existing software. We want to help customers have a consistent platform where they can run this anywhere. And we want to make sure that we give them the tools so that they can manage uh, this entire uh, uh, estate of uh, clusters and applications. Two key announcements there are Project Pacific and VMware Tanzu Mission Control. Project Pacific is uh, our effort to take Kubernetes and really build it in in a deep and fundamental way into our premier product, vSphere. We're using Kubernetes both to make vSphere itself better because we think Kubernetes is a great platform to build on, but then we're also making uh, vSphere, continuing to make vSphere an awesome place to run Kubernetes itself. Uh, we're doing this not just at the uh, Kubernetes level, but also at the hypervisor level. And then another big announcement at VMworld was uh, VMware Tanzu Mission Control. This is a service that allows customers to really take all of their Kubernetes clusters, regardless of where they're running and how they were launched, get visibility to see uh, how those clusters are doing, whether they're healthy, and then set policy across those clusters. So it really enables folks to, to you know, our customers to move from taking a look at a single cluster to really looking at all their clusters uh, uh, in a comprehensive way. Well, I think one of the things that really taken me by surprise is that we've seen excitement around Kubernetes uh, really across every country. And oftentimes we see these technologies start in one place and then sort of spread out from there. But it really has been a global phenomenon. For India specifically, one of the things that I'm excited about is the open source nature of Kubernetes. It really is a democratization of a tool set that really allows almost anybody to start building distributed applications uh, and start really embracing cloud native. And so both through open source, uh, I think you know, everybody can start using it regardless of where they are or how big a business they are. But then with partners like VMware, we can really help take it. enterprises take this to the next level so that bring Kubernetes to production with confidence. So Project Pacific and Tanzu and the Tanzu, uh, Tanzu Mission Control and the Tanzu effort in general, we think really provide uh, a packaging of the Kubernetes and cloud native experience that makes it accessible to almost every enterprise. Our goal is to make it so that companies can be effective and successful with their cloud native transformation journey uh, with VMware helping them along the way. Uh, we want to make sure that, especially through things like uh, uh, Project Pacific, 
that customers can actually run both virtual machines and uh, containers and Kubernetes right next to each other in an efficient and, and secure way.